welcome back to Queenie's Kitchen. Today we're going to be cooking barbecue spare ribs, baked beans, and devil eggs. So here's the seasonings I'm going to be using to season my ribs with. Nature seasoning, some Goya, lemon pepper, garlic powder, and seasoning all. I already have my onions and green peppers chopped up for my um, baked beans. Here's my baked beans already in a bowl. And here's my ribs that I'm going to be seasoning. All right, let's start seasoning these ribs. I already washed my hands, so let me put my gloves on. I hope y'all day is going well. Doing practicing y'all social distancing. Making sure you wash your hands and hand sanitize your hands. Especially if you have to go out in the public. I already have my oven preheated on 350. my ribs now we're just gonna flip them over I was going to cook them on the grill, but that pollen is crazy out there. So, in the oven they go. Season the other side. Which I just used this one for that one. Now I'm going to do my lemon pepper. That's it for that. So, the only thing I'm going to do now is just take it and put a little bit of water in it. Not a lot. So ribs are all seasoned and ready to go in the oven. All right, everybody. So next I'm going to be just sauteing my green peppers and onions to get it ready for my um, baked beans. Cooking the baked beans the way that my grandmama taught me. All right. I got olive oil in there to saute my baked beans. I mean, saute my onions and green peppers. Yeah. 
comme ça. Just let this cook until I think that they're sauteed enough. All right, guys. So next, I'm gonna be showing you how I do my baked beans. All right. So here's my sauteed onions and green peppers. I let them saute for about a good five minutes. Just put them inside your beans. Take your sugar and you put your sugar in here. It's a real easy recipe. Some people use hamburger meat. Some people use sausage meat. I use hamburger meat sometimes, but not all the time. So, what I usually do is just take like a little spoon and I taste the little syrup part to see if it's sweet enough for me. Let's add a little bit more. So here's the baked beans. I already got my oven preset. So I'm just gonna put them inside my oven. I'm gonna turn these little, these ribs around so that they can fit in there. Mm. I usually let my baked beans cook for about a good 45 minutes in the oven to make sure that they're good to go. You don't want to cook them that long because you don't want them to dry out. So if you start seeing that your baked beans are drying out, go ahead and pull them. Alright, so everything's in the oven. Alright, so next I'm going to be showing you how I do my devil eggs. What I put in my devil eggs is Duke's mayonnaise, pickle relish, sweet relish, some people call it and sugar. Let's get started. I already have my eggs de shelled. I'm gonna wash my hands. bowl to put my yolk, yolk in that little middle part so you just cut your egg in half like that put that in there put that in there So 
I got all my eggs cut. So next, the stuff right here, the little middle part, the yolk part, you just take it and break it apart with your hand. And if you have any leftover of it, if you like to eat egg sandwiches, hey, there you go. Let me wash this off my hands. Make sure you get that yellow part from out your nail get stuck in there when you smish, oops, smish it together with your hands That should be enough. You don't want a lot of mayonnaise because you don't want to, unless you like yours real wet. I don't like mine's real wet. sugar in there. Now, what I do is I add a little bit of cayenne pepper inside mine. You don't want to put too much because you don't want your mouth to be hot. Taste it to make sure. That it's sweet enough. I'm gonna get another spoon. Take it in, put it inside your egg.
that. Then I got my paprika. And I just take it and put a little bit on top of that. Alright guys, next I'm going to be showing you how I put my barbecue sauce on my ribs. This is what I use. These are the ribs. Oh, that's hot. I can't lift that, guys. And I'm just going to put some barbecue sauce in a bowl. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of seasoning to my barbecue sauce. Just gonna take this little thing and stir it up good. Mm -hmm. Got some barbecue sauce all stirred up. So what I do is I just take it and barbecue sauce on it a lot of people like a lot of barbecue sauce a lot of people don't like a, bar a lot of barbecue sauce me I really don't care but when you got picky people in the house guys don't think my hands not clean I wash my hands before I started doing this so I'm gonna get my tongs and I'm gonna flip them over
guys. So I'm just going to finish this. And after I finish it, I'm going to throw them back in the oven and let them cook for about a good 10 minutes. I'll let the barbecue sauce cook on top of them. And I'll be back. All right, guys, I'm going to show you my baked beans now that they're done. Get the camera right for you. These are my baked beans. Can you see? All right. All right, guys, so I'm here to show y'all the end results of my ribs and my baked beans and my devil eggs. Thank you guys for watching. Please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Tell a friend to tell a friend to share the video for me, please. See y'all later. Bye.